Welcome to this battery test of iOS 10.3.3, iOS 11.4.1, and iOS 12.2, including iOS 12.3 Beta 1, all on the iPhone 6S. So first, let's just run these phones through the initial checklist. First, we'll make sure that all phones are set to 25% brightness. And let's just verify that auto brightness is disabled on all the phones so that the brightness of the displays does not change as the light of the room changes. Before I forget, I just had the batteries replaced on all of these phones, so they are brand new batteries with less than 3 cycles on them all around. And as you will see here in a few seconds, all devices are at 100% battery capacity. And uh, since that feature is not available on 10.3.3, I show that using a tool called 3U Tools. So now all there's left to do is to launch Geekbench and run it on all four devices. And we are now ready to go, so let's start the test in 3, 2, 1, go. So iOS 12.3 beta 1 cuts out at 3 hours and 19 minutes, iOS 11.4.1 at 3 hours and 23 minutes, and iOS 12.2 at 3 hours and 28 minutes. But as you can see iOS 10.3.3 is by far finished, it keeps on going.
finally quits at 5 hours and 40 minutes. And there you have the scores again, 5 hours and 40 minutes for iOS 10.3.3 and all others around 3 and a half hours. I did find that kind of strange as I did not remember the big leap from 10.3 to 11. So I started looking at Geekbench and it turns out that Geekbench 4 apparently does not support 10.3.3 in the latest version, which is 4.3.2. Current version that supports 10.3.3 it's 4.2.3. So I figured that Geekbench probably put in some more excessive tests in uh, the latest version. So I decided to run a YouTube video test that just emptied the batteries showing a YouTube video countdown. So let's run that test right now. So while I start the test, so let me just uh, say that the devices have of course been charged to 100%. Uh, brightness setting is still at 25%. And uh, let's just run it and see how far each of the devices will go. We start counting down from 15 hours.
So well, it looks like iOS 10.3.3 is the big winner here. So it won big time on Geekbench, but those results are a bit dodgy due to the different Geekbench versions. But as you just saw, just running the YouTube video for a lot of hours, iOS 10.3.3 pulls ahead with about 1 hour and 10 more minutes of extra playtime. The other three versions of iOS follows the same pattern as we saw in Geekbench. iOS 12.2 comes in second place, iOS 11.4.1 in third, and iOS 12.3 beta 1 in fourth place. So based on these tests, it does look like Apple has degraded battery life for the newer versions of iOS since 10.3.3. However, if you look at 11.4.1, iOS 12.2 has improved some. So well, that's it for this video. As always, let me know what you think down in the comments. And hey, remember to subscribe to the channel and of course like this video.